Hey, so today is Sunday and you're watching The Biggest Beauty Project. <laughs> I'm really sorry about my absence in life as of late. Um, work has been absolutely crazy. I've been working more than 40 hours a week and this past week I've been getting home after 9 p.m. every day so it's been really stressful but I'm, I'm still here. I still love everyone. I've just been crazy busy lately. I don't know how regular my videos will be for the next like month or so during our busy season at work but I just want to make videos when, when I could. I still love the girls on the channel and all the viewers and everything. I want you all to know that I'm still here. I'm still a part of this channel. That hasn't changed. It's just things in my life are a little bit crazy right now. Okay, so two weeks ago was Pets Week um, and everyone talked about their pets. Nancy wanted everyone to share about their pets and I, I love that because I love animals. I do not have any though, um, so I didn't really miss out on talking about any of my pets. I love animals. When I have my own place, I totally plan on getting a pet. If I'm this busy, probably a cat or maybe two so they can entertain each other. Um, but I love cats and dogs. I've had a cat before, but I also really love dogs. Sam's cat, of course, I have met in person. And Caitlin's pets, I have met over video chat and I've seen pictures of um, Kelly's dog, Leah, but I hadn't seen Nancy's little palm yet and I love Pomeranians and Lola was so precious. So Nancy, thank you for, for sharing her with us. I know what you mean about her being older because you want to be able to spend more time with her and you know she's already what like seven or eight you said and so you know you know your years are limited but she is such a sweetie she looks so cute I love Pomeranians whenever I do get a pet or pets you guys will totally hear about it they'll be in like all of my videos because I, I will just be so obsessed so don't worry when when I have a pet you guys will hear all about it past week has been Kelly's topic and of course she wants to talk about Halloween because it's Halloween week and also I know Kelly loves Halloween um, and I have gotten to watch everyone's videos for this week. I'm finally caught up. Um, so I like to hear what you guys all thought about Halloween as well. I didn't get to do anything for Halloween this year, of course, because I was working. Also, the weather was pretty bad here. Um, but yeah, I didn't even dress up. I could have dressed up to go to work, but to um, work for 10 hours in a costume just did not sound pleasant to me. I do like Halloween. I don't know if it's my favorite holiday. It's a really fun holiday. Um, I liked it more back in the day of like high school and college when there were always like parties to go to and things to dress up for and always fun stuff going on around Halloween and now I don't really do much. See, so yeah, I don't really have any Halloween traditions. When I was in college I used to always like to go to the Rocky Horror Picture Show. Um, we dressed up a lot for marching band. If we had a game anywhere around Halloween we would have a Halloween game and dress up and we would have parties. Um, some of my friends would always have costume parties and it was just, it was a lot of fun, but now I don't do any of that. Favorite Halloween movies? I'm not really into scary movies at all. It's not my thing. I love The Nightmare Before Christmas. To make everyone feel old, this is the 20th anniversary of The Nightmare Before Christmas. I remember um, when my parents bought me that movie when I was a little kid, when I was like five when it came out, and I just loved it because I loved the idea of all the different holidays having their own little world, and it's just such a fun movie. Also one of my good friends from college, um, growing up she loved this Halloween movie called The Worst Witch and it was this like super super cheesy like late 80s early 90s movie and it was like so cheesy it's funny and like so um, she showed it to a bunch of our friends and we quote it sometimes. In the middle of the movie there's a random music montage starring Tim Curry and it is the wackiest most outrageous amazing thing and um, so if if you don't want to watch the whole movie, at least watch that clip because it's it's just crazy and it's it's just so funny to me because it's so weird. For Halloween candy, in general I really love Smarties and most people don't so I get a lot of those and that's nice. Um, I like the uh, suckers that are like green apple and they have like the caramely stuff on them, it gets all up in your teeth. I love those. And of course I love Reese's, all those Reese's pumpkins I talked about in a previous video. Yeah, I still love those. And costumes, like I said, dressing up is always really fun. I didn't dress up this year. Probably my favorite costume ever though was one year when I was in college. I went as a swarm of killer bees. What I did was I got a black shirt and I cut the letter B out of like a bunch of felt and um, splattered red paint all over them and then glued them to my shirt. So I had all these like letter B's that were covered and looked like blood and then I had like a fake sword knife thing and I carried it around and I was a swarm of killer bees and I wore that for marching band and nobody got it 
but I thought I was clever and I thought it was cute. Even though Halloween's not my favorite holiday because I don't really do a lot for it, I do like Halloween. I like costumes and dressing up and all like the fun kind of mischievous festive atmosphere. It's just a fun holiday. I just think it's really cool. Other than my crazy work schedule, things have been good with me. Um, it's November. Thor comes out next weekend and I am really excited to see that. I'll probably go see that next weekend if I'm not completely exhausted. Um, if I work another 50 hour week, which I mean, I could just sleep all next weekend. We'll see. Um, but I do really want to see Thor next weekend and you, you all probably know, but not because of Thor, because of Loki, because Tom Hiddleston I'm obsessed with. So yeah, really excited about that. Also it's November and the Doctor Who 50th anniversary is this month and I'm stoked for that. I won't be able to go see it in theaters. I know it's in theaters like that Monday or Tuesday, early that next week, a lot of different places. Um, but of course, I work until like seven or nine usually. So that's unfortunately not gonna happen, but you know, that that's okay with me. As long as I can watch it, which I know, you know, I don't work weekends anymore. So the actual show is on a Saturday, so I will be able to watch that and I will be freaking out about it the whole time. Catching Fire comes out soon. I'm so excited for that. I love The Hunger Games. Um, I love that book series and that first movie was really good. Catching Fire was actually my favorite book out of the series. From the previews I've seen it looks amazing and the first one they stayed really really true to the book and it seems like they probably won this one too and it seems like it's gonna be really well done of course so I'm excited to see that. The Hobbit comes out next month and so I'm just gonna be seeing movies in my free time apparently. I do have to start Christmas shopping though because um, you know, there's not that many shopping days between now and Christmas, and now I can only go on the weekends. Um, and I'm gonna have to start shopping for my Secret Santa. I know some of the girls on the channel have already, like, purchased their Secret Santa gifts, and that's awesome, and I have no idea what I'm even getting my person. Um, I'm gonna have to do some research. But yeah, I feel like there's a lot of stuff I wanted to say because I've been gone for so long. But yeah, things are good with me. I, I didn't want anybody to worry about me. I'm pretty sure I've not worked my last 50-hour work week. However, um, the busy season really only lasts through the beginning of December, so probably just like a month more of this craziness. But yeah, 